a bunch of our factories are closed as well. So the ones that are still open and are fully employed, let's go and upgrade them. How quick get land in, in China? I don't know, a war at some point, we declared on them. I don't remember what the timing was, but it worked out. Not even the original devs understand the economy of Victor. And that's true. There was constantly a problem where, like, the economies would just crash. And they wouldn't really know why. God, Persia. No wars going on. What kind of peaceful world are we living in? Everyone's deciding to be, uh... Pacifists. We only got, like, ten years left to go. All right. How do we get to minus 200 of them? Like, why could we take the decision? Oh, it's probably when we were secondary power. We could probably leave the sphere. We probably didn't need as much negative stuff. We need to become a secondary power again. Oh, there goes the economy, again. Just, just because the world decided that the economy should be bad again. Oh, now all of a sudden it's good again. You guys, everything is fine. Oh, we have so much control over our situation and fate. It feels good. We went from 18 back to 17. With a tiny little prestige boost. Pretty normal considering the world we live in. I mean, I guess there is that. Gain some free research points. Don't mind if I do. It's the bubble burst. Oh, that's okay. No, the bubble's back on, you guys. No wars going on with anyone. Again. I think the Great War experience is going to be useful. Oh, then we get tanks and more discoveries for war. Alright. We only got 10 years left to the game. I'm going to start a war with the UK, is what's going to happen. As soon as we can leave their, uh, their faction. Let me open and subsidize all factories. Because I want to boost my uh, my um, industrial score so I can become a secondary power again. I think the requirements if we're a secondary power aren't quite as bad for leaving the sphere. Um, well, I don't want militancy, so yeah, we'll push for less if I had, Although I'm, I like running the state capitalism. Oh, United Kingdom's back in second place overall. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Went from minus 200 to minus 9. Neighbors at peace, sure. Um. There you go. How come the decision's not lit up? Oh, I have to be a secondary power and have that. Okay. Well, hopefully we can get there. I think we're on the cusp of secondary power again. Uh, CB to leave sphere? I don't know. I don't have it. Because otherwise I'd have a, like, declare war kind of option. Liberate other things. I have gas tech. I don't know if they have gas tech, but we have gas attack at least. Yeah, sure, they can become more fascist. Come on, secondary power. 
boost our industrial score some more. Build boats. Oh yeah, I guess the boats would boost it. Let's actually increase the maintenance to boats. Not all the way, but some. We're doing this simply to raise our military score so that we can boost our world score some more. Stuff breaks, people die. Yeah, we'll quarantine it. Many upgrades, many beating up of people. Economy's still okay right now. Come on, give us, give us a, uh, give us a secondary power. I don't, we can't get just a chart of countries. Oh, maybe in the ledger. Heavy armaments. Technically, we'd start the ability to uh, be able to, like, build tank factories at that point. Well, I think we still need a discovery. Gas defense. Yes, it is very important. Now, that was... Gas defense. Now, can we boost the discovery rate? Oh, 0% chance. We have to be in a war with a country, basically, that has gas to be able to develop it. Ah, which is going to be tricksy. Anti-minority agitation. And denounce it. Try to bring people into our little group here. Oh, we slipped a position. Come on. Okay, well, let's uh, let's make friends with Russia. Called poor people for a reason. It's just such a shitty response. I'm gonna have to take it. Come on, guys. They're called poor people for a reason. So Koto has gone bankrupt, which does give us a CB against them. I don't know if that's really our plan. One of the rebels occupying your factories in China? Uh, no, we're okay here. Can you check the rankings on the screen of the Great Powers? I mean, you can see these. And you sort nation by rank. Uh, I think where we want to go is... I keep hitting L for the ledger, because that's what it is in other games. Um, nation ranking. We can just look at it here. So, Punjab over here, just slightly behind Switzerland. Because no military score. Yeah, they mostly have a lot of prestige. Whereas, on the opposite side, you've got Brazil, who've got nothing going on, really, except military score. Ships are still being built. Okay, we can't build any more army. We don't have the capacity for it. Although, you know, I think what we're going to do is we're going to remove these focuses. What year is it? Man. Uh, we're going to encourage soldiers. Which should hopefully give us a little bit more manpower to play with. Can we get anything? Okay, there's some prestige to be gotten here. We need to become a secondary power again so we can leave. Sort by the number in the Diplo screen. Oh, right there. There's the rank. Thanks. Okay. Build more ships. We are 84% literate now, 
which is kind of nice. Oh, there we go. Crises. Now, is it just a brewing crisis? Or is there war? There's no war right now. UK versus Germany. Here, I'm going to go negative tariffs here. So that we can... Our factories might be able to import better. Maybe it'll improve our military score a little bit. Um, and then the other thing is... Okay, you guys are still expanding, although you're not. Let's go ahead. Anyone who's at full employment, we'll go and upgrade you some more. White piece. Oh my god! No one wants to start any shit. Hey, we're secondary power again. Which means we have a decision. Which means we're going to leave the sphere of influence. Which means... We need a new justification. It's going to put our bad boy maybe over 20, depending on when it hits. And by how much. 8.5. Okay, we're still under 20, which is good. It's going to finish our military tech. And yeah, we're going to go for the UK. Even though it's kind of crazy. Um, I want to move all these guys over here. I don't suppose there's automatic transports. No. No automated transport. I mean, China might decide to jump on us at that time, which would be unfortunate for us. I still have some rebellion. Only 208 brigades, which ain't much. Oh, they are being hit at somewhere by some units somewhere. We have over 2 million banked. Um, what we might want to do, actually, is before the war starts, is actually take an opportunity to stockpile some military goods. Um, turn off automation, make a giant purchase, and then turn it back on again. Soft limit is 25, okay, so we're still definitely fine. Build up your military. It's pretty built up, although we could mobilize. Oh, no, we can get some more dudes. Excellent. Get a few more hussars. And then we're going to get guards, because we have the money. We're going to buy fancy schmancy stuff. Okay. Um, and we are still working on the justification. Yes. Okay. We're not in anyone's sphere. I mean, we shouldn't be. Let's keep relations low over here, just to make sure. There's the CB. Uh, we might just lose all these units as they're boating around, but I don't know. We'll try anyway. Here's it. Okay. The war with the UK is coming. Uh... Diplomat on route. It is coming. We might want to land these this boat load first, though. Whatever, I don't care about that. Yeah, we'll land this boat load and then go. I guess we're still training. Oh, should mobilize. Excellent. Number one great power. So, uh, so um, the UK's gone back to number two, which is nice. But yeah, Germany over here. Number one great power. Yeah, we'll have to play a European campaign there at some point. See what that's like. Where are you, fleet? I don't want you to get sunk. I also don't want to lose the CB. Alright, we pro we can probably go now. Place in the sun. Um, so... If there's a specific one we're interested in grabbing. It's just cloth and things. Probably more coast. I don't know. We'll uh, we'll say we'll declare for Gujarat. Call in our allies. All right, let's go. Declare war in the United Kingdom. Welcome. Welcome to the end game. Oh my God! All of our troops here from our mobilization. That was crazy.
No one's willing to join our war. Welcome to Attrition Town. Population, not as many people as there were. Let's move you there. Squash some fools. Oh. Modern army doctrine. All right, big battle against Ook over here. That that one? No, that's a different one. Okay. Uh. one here. We don't have very good morale right now. Um, they have a minus one, which is kind of nice. E both sides have gas attack. And, yeah, there's no gas defense. So, the fatalities in these battles is going to be humongous. Like, both sides are going to lose so many people. So, yeah, if we look at the war, it's us versus, like, the UK, wait, and Germany? <laughs> this is fine, you guys. I think we may lose that battle, which is a little annoying. Actually, stay paused. Undermanned brigades, we're just gonna get rid of you. Um. I just want to go down here. No, I don't know. Let's bop some dudes. Just nuke them from orbit. It's the only way to be sure. Girl's finishing. Uh, Dragoon attack and things. Okay, that's a really helpful list of mods. Although, what we really need is gas defense. Which we should now be working on full speed. Oh my god, look, both sides, almost everyone is just gone. Is that minus 23 from that battle? I wasn't actually expecting it to be that severe. Oh, turn off the rebel stomp, yeah. He saw from Germany. We just stand in white peace. Well, there's a gas defense. Ah. Uh, I mean, there's just too many people. God damn it. God damn it. Well, there goes the dream. I mean, it really was just a dream. Oh, we can go and pass a new law. Now, the biggest movement is campaign for public meetings, which is actually over here. We get don't, can't mess with that. Minimum wage is the next biggest, so we'll run that just to satisfy them. guys need to restock, but it'll take a while. Punjab fought the world in World War Well, I mean, we, pa paused, we, we fought them to a standstill. Which is kind of hilarious. Just like that. We have tons of dudes here again. Wow, the supply limit here. 111. Wow. 
I mean, we did get a lot of supply limit tech. I'm above my boat limit. Yeah, why did that happen? Well, let's, um... Get our clippers. Just gonna disband these clippers. We're still above our boat limit. Now, do we have... Maxed out. I guess we don't really have naval base tech. Ninety percent of the country is occupied. Let's call it a draw. Hey, man, it was totally draw to me. I don't know why they just want to pe white piece out. Clearly, we were very intimidating. Oh my god, so much attrition walking through there. Oh my god, so much attrition. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to split these stacks into two. I guess our goal is simply going to be maintaining second power status. Oh, we don't have any unemployed. All our factories are basically, uh... 